Hello everyone, Fab Design here, and joining me tonight is gonna be Crypto. Hey everyone, yes, I'm Crypto. Glad to be back for I think this is my third game now. I do think so, and uh, tonight's game is gonna be Lefront versus Axpy. Gonna play on hill base, and we see Lefront's lineup consisting of Medic, Grenadier, Para, Sniper, and another Para. But as for Axby, it's gonna be Para, Medic, Grenadier, Engineer, and Snap. So what's your thoughts of uh, on this match so far, uh, Crypto? What do you think? Oh, well, I like the lineups, and we're getting very late into the league now, I believe. So uh, yeah. as things progress, yes, I'm expecting some very good things from some very skilled players tonight. Yeah, uh, quick reminder, this is week 7, and... Lefront and Axby are playing for a pretty important match in uh, their Group A. So we see Lefront going first with his Medic. Finds the Medic Ooh. immediately. Yes, the old meta strategy of paralyzing the Medic. Yep. Seems uh, very much a uh, player's favorite. Axby is gonna go with his Para now. And uh, as you can see, this map is one of the beta maps introduced by Pins mod. Uh, the latest one, I think. So, it's a bit of a dull map. We, we're gonna see some HP crates fall uh, later on, I think, if I'm not mistaken. But other than that, um, there's a bunch of hills. Uh, the map is quite divided, but pretty bleak. So, yes, it does look very dull. Unless there's any vehicles to liven it up, I did eventually. Oh, it has potential. Indeed. indeed. But Axby's Para just manages to get one um, jetpack. I would be good. I would be good, but just one jetpack. So now the front gets yeah. his grenadier turn. He's gonna find the other grenadier, as you can see. <laughs> Seems like the grenadier and grenadier is also almost as meta as medical Ooh. medic. Oh, oh, that was nice good. damage there as well. Did and Axby's medic misses the turn. They are quite lined up. Both of uh, the players have a scout, so we might see some poison, uh, some multi-poison, but we'll see, we'll see. It's um, still early to say that. Yes, yeah, so on, on maps with a lot of uh, higher ground like this, uh, a lot of, you know, canyons almost form, where poison mm -hmm. gas rolling down there can be lethal. Yeah, and we don't see the paratroopers uh, getting too much... Um, of that high ground advantage. Well, Axe Base Para is still up, up but Lefront's still still below there. Now it's the turn for Axe Base Grenadier to wreck some havoc. Let's see. Is he gonna go for the Medic? I don't think so. He's going for the Grenadier, it seems like. Which is still full health. This could be good. Mm hmm. Just has to... With his uh, equal grenadier on very on a lower health, equalizing that could be a uh, very good move. And seems decent. Seems very decent. I've seen Axby do this uh, a bunch of times now. He waits for the right moment, you know. He doesn't do the double click, which, to be honest, can be a little unreliable on Parsec. You know, you don't know if your hits are going to register in time, so... Let's see in the front scout. Goes straight with a 40. Simple sniper. Is he gonna go for the body block? Oh. Finds the grenadier and that's it. Upwards and down. He's and he's dead. So that's he the grenadier. He might even down. do some more um, blast damage. Oh no no no, he's far. And Axe by Grenadier is already down. So we that's have the first kill of the game to the front. Indeed, I don't think we have seen. Okay, we're gonna see. Oh, it's just on thirty-nine. Okay, so Lefron's Grenadier is also gonna say goodbye to <laughs> to the game for now. Yeah. And just like next... I said earlier, that cluster grenade to equalize the health was probably a, a good a good move. Absolutely, absolutely. You want to bring that Grenadier down as fast as possible, almost as fast as a medic. <laughs> And the full damage, just as an insult. 
Okay, so I think Lefron's um, para still has yeah all the three jetpacks. Let's see how he uses them. It's a, well, that could be enough time to get three jetpacks in as well. We might even potentially. Uh, what was his health? We could see a kill, could we? Um, I'm not sure. I don't think there is time for three jetpacks plus a bazooka. I would go for two plus bazooka. Yeah. Oh, 41! No. That's Ooh. unfortunate! It's gonna live another day, <laughs> no matter how good uh, Lefron's shot is. Just one head jump. I think he was contemplating that too. I mean, you know, he would have lived anyway. That was a pretty hard shot, so... I mean, uh, Lefron does have more turns to take care of the medic, but Axe is gonna retaliate with his snipe. I never know how to call them, snipers or scouts. Which one you prefer, uh, Crypto? Uh, to be honest, I always just refer to them as snipers, snipers. just because of the rifle. Yeah, 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 that uh, makes sense. I just go, I, I guess uh, I'm very influenced by the title on their heads, but I think snipers is a fit, Ooh. more fitting. Oh, no! Uh, Ooh. Wait, 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 just hold on, hold on. Oh, Might oh, go back. Oh, oh, oh. oh. yes. Stay. <laughs> But now oh, the jet yeah. the HP crates come down and the orderly can take one. No, no, no. He doesn't need it. He's gonna tranquilize some. But the question is, who's gonna track? <laughs> Seems very undecided on his inventory. Goes again for the para, which is, uh, in my opinion, a pretty smart move. I suppose. Paratroopers can be lethal and... Axe by does not have... Oh yeah, he still has a medic, but... There we go. Immediately lo loses his turn. So the front might... Bounce to that HP crate. That, do you think he's gonna go for that? Uh, if he has any jetpacks, I think it would be a smart move to get out of the way and use the bazooka quickly and he's, collect the health crate. If I'm not mistaken, he has one left. Hmm, but what is he, he doing? Might just be taking a run up at it, or...? Sorry? He might, not have time. he might not have time for a shot now, I don't think, but he could still scrape the health. Yeah, um... Wait, what... Hmm. That was an interesting move. I mean, he went for a surefire, you know. Uh, I guess he didn't want to use a jetpack when he was so distant in case he couldn't reach it, but... This is good. Yeah, I... wasting a final jetpack would have been a very uh, bad thing. Yeah, if you think about it. I mean, the, oh no, he might not land on it, no! Oh. <laughs> oh no. That's painful to watch. But Axe Spice Medic still lives. I think it's been quite a big decision to leave this medic alive. But what could you do? Mm. I mean... <laughs> yeah, just with that last move, without that head jump. Mm -mm. Even though he missed the shot and didn't get the perfect 40, it could have still... It could, it could have been a kill. Right, right. That would have sped things up a little bit. Still, uh, I think if Axpy wants that health crate, he'll have to be careful not to blow it up too. Unless he could just mm -hmm. aim at it, use it for the explosion damage. Oh, yeah. But he decides to instead... I mean, this uh, scout is going for a body block and a gas grenade. Let's see if it manages to hit it, and it does. Yeah. Nice. More HP. On all the corners of the map, but I don't think the sapper can uh, actually go grab it. I mean, we do have three health crates on the map, so that could actually negate some poisons if the pigs can get to them. Exactly, exactly. So, uh, you know... Maybe the medic could heal. One of the medics could heal on the next turn, but but where is the where is Xpy going with his sapper? Oh, of course, of course, he wants to destroy. Oh, what? He's still going for <laughs> going for the. Could be uh, big actually, especially if he gets the trick shot. Oh my god! Oh wait! Oh, it does oh. fifty-nine damage. Straight to the para, which won't be able to heal his poison either, and straight off misses another turn. What a bunch of turns from Axby. Very good at taking advantage at the right time. So we'll see how he keeps going with this smart move so far. 
I was gonna say, I'm not sure an engineer can get to the health rates, but he can be very successful at removing them, you know. Oh, and he's just 46. One nice sniper shot would be enough for him to lose the turn. Don't want to be too close, exactly. Wow. I'm just scooping up these stolen turns. Exactly. I think uh, Axpa is stepping up his game, but the medic might go and find a... Yeah. It's not too hard for him to heal him, but it's still gonna be just 26. One hmm. more grass grenade could be enough to bring him back to this state. Well, just, you know, with one head jump, I guess. <laughs> Pretty close match so far. And he goes for a Trank. On the Sapper. And a nice body block as well. Hmm. So, x is um, Para, I think he's out of... Uh, uh, if I'm not mistaken, he's out of jetpacks. No, it oh, was no, the other he, one. He, he has two. Because he's carrying two paratroopers. Let's not forget that. So, he finds the... Oh! oh <laughs> very smart move. I don't think it's still enough for using his turn nicely, but... No, oh, yeah. maybe and it's a It's a 50. I mean, this is pretty big. That's a nice heal. And does he make the shot? Um, 160 no. health. That's pretty oh. good. Oh. The intention was good, though. <laughs> so now, this para is going to try and get the last HP in the map. I don't think there's going to drop any more. Oh, uh, is he going to oh, make it? No. No, he misses. Dang it. I also thought he was closer. Uh, somehow I miscalculated, just like the front did. Well, what's he gonna do now? I'm not sure why he's uh, taking out the. Oh, of course, this pig is only seven HP left. Okay, and the medic is out. Could be a tiny bit of uh, explosion damage. Yep, we heard a grunt. Just seven, seven HP. And next by Mrs. Eterna, and spends ten more HP. In his poison. Well, a front scout or sniper still full health, so this can be pretty big. Okay, he has a paratrooper right in front of his face. Could be a nice clean shot there. Indeed, it is. At least a focus shot. I don't think it would have been possible to really throw an accurate poison up there, would it? Oh, Maybe that not worth it. That one extra health crate on the map. Oh, yeah. Hmm. I'm not sure. I believe that uh, paratrooper that landed there actually had two jetpacks, so he could potentially take another crate. Potentially, but as you can see, I mean, it's basically at the other side of the map, so it would still take at least one full turn. It could be a lucky one again. Maybe worth it. Mm -mm. I think Axe is going for a double here, which is very doable. Well, it could be with the right Ooh. angle, but. Oh my god. No! Oh, no. he gets one at least. <laughs> that curvature, that, that hole in the map, could have been vital. Could have been big. So, Lefron's two paras still alive so far, but one of them not for long. And this is his last jetpack. He's gonna try and get it. And with this, um, the jetpacks are out of the map out of the game so no more jetpacks but i mean they were enough for all the head health health packs to get taken oh and it's another 50 so i think so far we've seen axby taking one and lefron taking another one so if, correct me if i'm wrong i think it's just uh, pretty even so far yeah it's pretty even so far although just a little short on that shot though <laughs> yeah Knocking him down from there would have probably actually been oh. very useful. Oh, Bobby but he does have the other jetpack. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. Uh, this is gonna be a tough one. It might be very impactful though. Oh, pretty, pretty yeah. clean. A nice 36, and he's down from his perch. Oh yeah, we still have a medic on a sapper. Sapper. What's he gonna do? Dishing out some heating and 
I think he's out of tranks. Did I? No, I think he still has one. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure either, but he's gonna I think heal he his... might have time for his heal. He's gonna, yeah, he's probably gonna heal his uh, snipe, scout, sniper. Oh, but there is no time. Well, just enough for one healing. Ah, oh, no, oh, that's no. unfortunate. <laughs> that's really painful to watch. No, oh, just shot. If he just used that one last second, then maybe he would have got it. But just yeah, should have just so done close. one step further. Oh well, not all is lost. Not all is lost. It's still three v three. It's yeah, it's still a very open game. Wait, I think it's four v three. Yeah. Although uh, that could be some very oh brutal God. damage here. Yeah, you're right. This was a mistake. All things considered. It's gonna be at least 40, 49 and 48, something like that. Never mind. <laughs> what a tree. And Ooh. this guy is at his yeah, last oh. breath. Well, hmm. I think it's starting to look like x by might be having a lead here. Slightly. If, I think if with his last breath, if the front's paratrooper here could maybe make a good shot on his last turn, then he might even think out slightly, but I do... I am starting to feel a little bit of a lead here. Hmm. He decides to go for one last shot. Ah, no. That Damaging wasn't... his own pick. Uh, and this... Okay, I suppose he's planning to execute his own pig at the next turn, we'll see. Maybe with a simple head jump. Axe Bike goes for the poison to the freshly healed paratrooper. And he does. So what do you think so far then? You know, looking back on the game so far, what would you have to say? Uh, well... I think Lafront has been kind of unlucky with his uh, turnarounds and just a tiny bit less efficient at the time management, I would say. Axpay has been pretty consistent. He's been, you know, using his paratroopers. I think bringing two paras um, to the game has been pretty useful. Yes, especially with those health crates. Absolutely. Uh, it, this is uh, the first game I've commented where they've actually been used to get health crates rather than <laughs> just burn in a turn. Yeah, you always see jetpacks just used to dish out that extra damage per turn, but this kind of is the spirit of them. Using them to reach other points of the map. And we see X by taking a <laughs> shot at the medic. Good shot. And now I think we'll see Lefront jumping on his uh, Herkut's head. It seems like a pretty easy jump over there. And there we go. No turn so skip. Finish? Exactly. Yes. Hopefully those turns will be quite crucial at this point, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we, uh, he has to focus on the scout if he can find it. Or just, yeah, take that part out because He's the other one. down. Might actually be it. Oh, it does. It does. Uh, it falls back. Yeah. No full damage though. He slides down quite nicely. Lots of poison pigs, as you expect. But I think Axpy might get rid of uh, the front medic already. Yes. Even with uh, the head I... jump and the uh, and the shotgun. Yeah, one a couple of jumps if they if they hit and then the shotgun will do it. You're right. Yeah, I think he's gonna Maybe. go with that solution, as you can see. It's just I hope for him that all the shots will hit the spot. Because sometimes no. And just as I say it, just as I say it, only two bullets no. Only two bullets hit him, I think. Or something like that, like I think three. Jinxed. Basically missed three shots. I jinxed it. I'm sorry, Aspect. When you will rewatch this. You know what happened? 
And I think this medic will finally be able to dish out his healing <laughs> that he wanted to dish to to give earlier. Well, I and mean, to cool be that one. <laughs> yeah. Will he sacrifice his own thing? I don't think so. It would be wise to keep him alive, and perhaps do a little body block. Oh, he has to be quick. Oh no. Oh, no. Not I quite think... angled, you know. Was he, do you think he was panicking a little bit with the time? I I do think so, especially with the medic limping like that. Kind of throws you off. Wow, Axe Spike Scout is uh, still beefy. Completely forgot about his uh, extra HP pool. 190 health. Goes for the medic. For the old Yeah, it's more than worth the damage. Oh, though. and he didn't even no. do any. Uh, just some self damage. <laughs> but that grenade was pretty good. Yeah, it was a good grenade. Right in the middle of him. Mm -mm. So now it seems like there's mm, not too much left for Lefron to try. Guess he can go with the with old body block and the uh, uh, sniper rifle shot. We'll see. Yeah, this is good. Axe by well, with, the with, with the sniper with only two turns left, uh, if he isn't hit uh, yeah, already, but he... that one last TNT shot. <laughs> yeah. Axe by gets basically out of the body block. He was. Uh, Lefron did not calculate that body block correctly, but who can blame him? So now he goes for the scout, Bazooka. I don't know if you want to stay there. I mean, it's not like he can get knocked out of the map very easily, but he gets a 39. And that's enough yeah. for the scout to go. Oh man. I think he's safe from being knocked out of the map, though. And we can certainly see this lead starting to form. Though. Yeah, I mean, at this point, the lead is quite inevitable. It's uh, 3v1, you can even say just like 2v1, because the sapper just has one more turn. But one more turn with the sapper might mean one extra TNT, which I think he still has. And if not, he has a shrapnel switch. The sapper has yeah. two oh, turns. Oh, oh. But that was a perfect Ooh, nice shot, shot from left round. Perfect. We'll see how this yeah. happens last turn, how it goes. Oh yeah, he will die on the next turn. He might just want to stay where he places the TNT, but... Or he can try with the well, shrapnel. He could, he could, if he stays there and <laughs> sacrifices his pig, he, he could get a uh, trick shot from there. Oh my Ooh. goodness. There we go. It launches him. We're not sure of the damage though made to this. Okay, that was a 50, I think. Left with 60. Yeah, it landed just behind no, him. No, I, don't, no. I think. Right, was it? Oh, I'm not sure. No, actually, we were looking at the wrong pig, I think. Um, no, sorry. I mean, this is left front's only pig, so never mind. Don't think that's much. Left, but it is could be at least enough to get rid of the of the para. Oh no! Oh, just Almost. two. So unlucky. So, with only one left, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sixty health. This is looking to be uh, the end game for this one, I think. Yeah, I don't think there is enough, <laughs> like, enough turns for Le Front. It's, came, it's come closer than I thought it would in the end, but... Yeah, and in fact, Le Front closes it with a bang, bringing Game 1 to Axe-Buy so far. Good game. <laughs> indeed, indeed, it was, uh, considering how bleak the map generally is, other than the HP, uh, it was an entertaining match, so Axeman 94 gets it, and we'll see you guys in game number two in Axeblog. See you soon. And we're back in uh, game number two in Iceflow, again with Lefront versus Axeby. This time, Axeby is going to start. 
So we see the front lineup. Uh, on ice floor is gonna be medic, grenadier, two engineers, and a para. And Axpa is bringing medic, grenadier, engineer, para, and one other engineer. So, ice flow. What do you have to say about it, crypto? I know you actually like this map, right? Yes, Ice Flow is actually uh, one of my favorite maps, uh, from competitive at least. I never really played much multiplayer as a kid, uh -huh. but uh, it's actually yeah one I remember very fondly from when we had our first uh, face-off. Oh yeah, indeed. I, I, I also really like this map. It's so fun in general, and um, there is a lot uh, to play with on the map. So we have, you know, battles, uh, poison uh, water, mines, uh, just the more the merrier, right? So we see finally... Yes, very uh, hazardous. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it for that. And it's even better to watch uh, <laughs> people play this game in um, this map on a competitive uh, level. So I think x is getting ready. Yeah, yeah. He was like reading the mojo of the game. Getting some, you know, the spawns, like the biggest problem I feel like of Ice Flow from a competitive standpoint is the spawns are very, very random. Other than that, I think it's a great map. If we could get this a little fixed, you know, like for example, now we see <laughs> poor Axby has two uh, of his pigs just spawned in the central. Um, uh, oh, this could be brutal. Oh, yeah. Doesn't get the oh, mines. No. But still tranquilized though. Indeed. And interestingly yeah, that's one enough. thing I agree with you on. The spawn points mm -hmm. can be very annoying. Like you see with those pigs, the sapper would be stuck. <laughs> uh with just a grenade launcher, really. But well, what is the front doing? Uh, you can't get out without swimming. Right. And this is quite of an unpopular uh move. Oh no, it doesn't get to destroy the the crate. I totally saw what he was going for and would have been really good, but doesn't quite manage. Again, the grenade launcher proves once again a terrible weapon. Just a terrible weapon. <sighs> yeah, it just doesn't. It just bounces so quickly off of everything, and it's just so hard to get that perfect damage. Exactly. Even if you land the shot. Exactly. A and the range, even like the blast radius, is so weird and small. But Xpress Grenadier takes. Oh my god! <laughs> Ooh, that's, that's a lot of self damage. I think it's like 20 something, but still. I think I saw a 30. You did? Oh my god, I actually am unsure. You it might, might have right. been like a 1 and 3 or something, or a 5, maybe, from the uh, sh shrapnels. Mm -mm. And. Cluster, sorry. Oh, X by takes the plunge. Of course, for a brave move. I mean, otherwise, his engineer would have been completely useless. It goes for the medic. This is, unless you can get him in the water, which seems very hard. There's no way to get rid of the medic already. Let's see. Maybe he can bounce on the house. Um, no. Straight up, 50 damage. Still good. Still good. The building saves his own pig very effectively as well. Hmm. You're right. So now, the front engineer. Oh, this might be lethal. This might be... You think yeah, he can actually act kill him? If he lines it up right, uh, so he kind of keeps sliding down again, then I think that would be a kill. Yeah, he would have to go below 75 though, to actually explode. Which means... Uh, at least two mines. mines. Oh, yeah, exactly. oh my god, he fell oh, into the mine! No. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh, what no. is happening? No, no. Oh no! <laughs> uh, but, okay, Axby's uh, engineer does not explode, but gets the <laughs> the water. What happened there? Wow. <laughs> wow. A, a, a messy turn. <laughs> I was not expecting that. It was a fun tiny mistake. Made that yeah. very uh, funny turn. Yeah, and Axby, interestingly enough, does not go for the Grenadier, but rather to the Para. I mean, it seems an easier shot. Um, might be able to get rid of the, of the engineer. Oh. See, I would take out the paratrooper because he's very mobile and he can blow uh, pigs into minefields and the poison and the water. True. So he, he might be very, you know, useful, gone quickly. True, and he still has all his jetpacks and his arsenal, so... But doesn't get out of the game yet. 
I think the Frons gonna take advantage of this and try and put Axe by Spara in the mines, in the minefield. Let's see how it goes. Ooh, he could he could get it, just if it's very shallow like that. that might work. Hmm, I think he's gonna overshoot it sadly. The TNT has a large blast um knockoff. What he's just done though is bunched his pigs up Ooh, on the edge no near the water. Oh, Never that? mind. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. What an amazing shot from uh, from uh, the front. There is, there is a potential for a revenge shot here. Oh, yeah. Those two pigs are very close together. If they're not moved quickly, then they could both go into the poison or the water. They're yeah. actually quite close to the mines too. So. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But the big question is, do you want to spend an engineer's turn to get rid of the of this medic here? And also, ah. Uh, I think this is a pretty bad position to be at because of the battle there. Hmm. It could be safe, but he could take a little bit, maybe 20, 30 damage out of that, but. Mm -mm. It's still too close to my liking. I wouldn't <laughs> yeah. stand there, but. With one of those pigs moved, that's the uh, potential double kill. Mm. Oh! Gone. <laughs> the medic saves the para from falling, and. Uh... Oh! Wait, if he lands there, then... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. He got... <laughs> I think he lost his turn there. Ooh. But... Okay. Well, unlucky, but I think it still did what he wanted to. Yeah, he almost fell into the mines, too. <laughs> yeah. Because he slipped off the edge. Hmm. So I think Axe by his pigs are quite bunched up right now, but the Medicates at least can uh, dish out some healing as usual, as you expect. Huh. Right. He so that Sapper's uh, journey was worth it then? Yeah, but now he has to be very quick at shooting. Oh my god, it might be... Oh, that's oh, good. That's it. At the very last uh, millisecond. But the front still has the Grenadier! x may needs to be careful now. Um, it, it might be a little distant. But it might be enough. What do you, what do you think? Uh, is this doable in your opinion? Uh, it, it could bounce a little bit. It, if it bounces over the pig, but it will probably connect with the land. Oh, it seems like it's... Oh, actually, oh my god! Oh, Whoa! Perfect. That was a handbook. Uh, cluster shot And he's right down near the poison. Indeed. Oh, x base Grenadier is also still alive, by the way. No one's going for the crates, though. Hmm. Yeah. I believe the rocket launchers in those crates, they could be, uh, quite useful for, uh, actually knocking some of the pigs into the poison. Yeah. I mean, they do 50 damage as well, but that seems good. Oh! Briefly falls into the water again. Hmm. Could be that um, he does one grenade shot, but I don't know. I don't know if it's uh, viable. So now. Axe by his engineer is going for the rocket launcher in that crate. Oof. It's very, very low on health. It doesn't want to go below 25. I mean, it's already poisoned, so whatever. But goes for the, for the rocket. Does he find the pig, though? Ah, he does Ooh. miss, but it's fine. Wow. Oh, no. That was actually very good. Holy. Ooh. Right, You're just just hitting behind them. <laughs> the rocket launch is so, uh, you know, no pun intended, hit and miss. <laughs> yeah. When it comes to the uh, explosion damage behind it, it, it's just sometimes you can be a millimeter off and it'll fly straight past the pig. Yeah, for some reason this time, uh, even if it was technically a miss, it was still a pretty big shot. And ah, oh, uh, left front engineer falls in the water, the poisonous one. So now what's he gonna do? It's gonna shrapnel. Perhaps going for a trick shot here. Staying wisely distant from the uh, from the battle, but it's not enough for the shrapnel. 
for the friction. So Axe Bay's engineer is now down to 56. Hmm. Who's gonna go for? He sees Ooh. a bunch of pigs, but huh. it's tempting. Hmm. Could this work? I think that's too far away to set it off, but it might be just close enough. I was thinking just? the same thing. I don't think he's enough. I actually don't think I it's don't enough to prime it. We'll get him close to it, but over the other side. Yeah, it doesn't prime it. Be uh, supposedly, I think because of the height this difference as well. So, front goes with his param. He's probably gonna collect that TNT, which he needs so, so importantly, so desperately, I would say. Hmm. Ooh. Oh, of yeah, course. Not Hold down. Oh, no. What is it trying to do? Do you think he's gonna reach? Oh. Oh, 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 I think he... Too much bullet drop, he might do it. No, see, the bullet drop no. is... Of the... Of the machine gun is so big. They drop that medic so is very close to the barrel. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He doesn't want to stay there. He needs to relocate. So right now, I think... Uh, oh my god! He falls up the slot. Hold on. Oh, he Just goes for a... Okay. What is it? Hmm. Oh, well. Ooh. No! It's enough. <laughs> it was a good shot, but a little too good. Doesn't get the skip turn. Huh. Yeah. I don't know about you, I would have gone for a trank shot there because he would have uh, tranquilized him and also missed another turn right after that one. But this worked, I guess. <laughs> I suppose, I mean, getting the kill was safe. Uh, if the trank missed, then it would have still been a wasted trank. But if it went well, then you're right, that would have been pretty deadly. That is true, he still uh, can use the trank some other ways. So. And that's it for uh, Abraham, x by Marie. Oh no, never mind. <laughs> Sorry. No, I thought he was at 39. Ooh. That's pretty brutal. Last turn for this guy here. Unless the medic can heal him, of course. Of course. Ooh, <laughs> I keep forgetting, like. Yeah. Does anyone have... Uh, how many people use the tactic of just walking backwards to, you know, with a damaged pig to actually get there faster? Oh, it depends, really. I think... Uh, I haven't seen that very often. Um, the front was using it for a bit, but then he found out that it's really hard to know where you're going in that case. Oh! Oh my god, this was super Ooh. risky, x by And he gets... <laughs> oh no, it's down to eight! Ow! Oh, oh that, sorry, that 8 was the Grenadier, of course, sorry. But still, pretty pretty big self-damage there, I think. Well, he's doomed, though, at 8. Yeah. Yeah, he's definitely going into the poison there, mm -mm. I think. Wow, I think Lefront is slowly getting an edge here. He is, he's managed uh, to claw back a bit of a lead, I think. Especially if this is a kill. It might be worse than a kill. Oh no, it is, it is. Well. And that's it for the medic from Axpy. His last transmission was save the pigs. Save them for me. Mm. But he, there is Did no way. That? Mm. Just a little bit less than 50 and exactly. he has to turn. Why not place it a little bit more distant? I don't think he needs to. Uh, I, yeah, I think he's it. trying. Um, I think. Um, he, no, no, I think it's a bull. <laughs> that could it, be 50. Yeah, yeah, I think so. It's a 49. Oh, <laughs> it's still... yeah. It should have been a little less... Oh, he could have even killed his own pig with that. But no. When is the Grandier going to take the turn? I think it's going to be the next one. Hmm. Yeah, I think so. So, the paratrooper moves all the way across the map. 
I wonder who's gonna target. See, initially, it Ooh. seemed like uh, the front occupied the outskirts of the map, while Axby had the uh, main island, and now there's been a bit of invasion. Is there? Uh, what's gonna happen here? Well, we know what's gonna happen. The sapper is not gonna survive. But... Oh my god! Sometimes they clip through the building; they can uh... land on top of it. Oh, you're right. I think he just exploded very fast. Not sure how. Actually, yeah, there was no death animation. Mm -mm. He just exploded. I wonder if he did get stuck. <laughs> yeah, I think so. We could, we could uh, like, it depends if we see a pair of boots on the house. Um, then he didn't get stuck, but I don't know. Oh, oh my god, what is... Oh, okay. Well. Oh, nice shot, but no, Axby gets unlucky once again. But I think he would have died anyway because this guy would have exploded. So, you know, he did well. He did yeah, very well. There's no, I know he could have swum away from that. I think we're yeah. both dead anyway. At least he managed to kill his own pig before he lost the turn, though. Oh, and now he's 1v1. Very close, but Lefron still has Ooh. all the jetpacks. Can be lethal, can be huge. If he goes towards the water, then. He has to not waste his turn, that though. Damage. Oh my god. Is there it? Comes. He goes for the scoop. The scoop of that, and that's it. Lefron yes. goes and ties. Now they are one to one on game each. So this means that the next game will happen, and it's gonna be on U Hillock, which is uh, a pretty interesting map. Well, congratulations, a front well played for now, even the score. Yeah, uh, absolutely, absolutely. So. We'll see you guys in the game three of this of this match. This is gonna be interesting. And we're back once again for game three of uh, Axe Pie versus Lefranc. This is gonna be very interesting. It's gonna be played in the U Hillock, and Lefranc's gonna go with the medic, grenadier, engineer, para, and engineer. Axe Pie is gonna go with the medic, para. Uh, sorry, medic, grenadier, para, engineer, and scout. Can't wait to start. Uh, Crypto, you want to say something about this? Yeah, I just think LaFont took a very good second game there, and this is actually, of the three games I've commented, this is the first time I've ever seen a tiebreaker round, so I'm actually really looking forward to this one. <laughs> yeah, the it's most important... It's been very so far. Yeah. And uh, we see... Yeah, Axe by taking the first turn. So this is, you know... You look it's a strange map. I mean, it's one of the base ones, of course. It's in the game already, but there are so many islands. Uh, it's kind of um, not so easy to go from one part of the map across the other one. And there's mines, as you can see. Uh, Axe by already took one. And that's the good old mm -hmm. medical medic action. The front misses his turn already. Ah, this can be huge, actually, for, for Axe by. You know, when you start with a medic first, um, it always feels like um, you're, you're you're playing um, a lot of your your how can I say your game becomes very very important uh, and reliant on starting first. So since both of them did start with a medic this time, I would say this is already a little bit of a kickstart for Axpy, which now goes with a very good cluster there. Yeah. yeah, that was a good cluster, I, mean, I agree, but uh, the thing is, that I think they got lucky with the spawning, did they, in this one? For the <laughs> medic to spawn so close together that the trank would work so quickly. You're right. That was uh, very lucky for Axpy, at least, for sure. That looks good. Oh! Whoa! What a jump! Whoa, whoa. No! Oh, just no water, though. <laughs> no water and no fall damage. Usually, you get a little bit of fall damage. I mean, actually, yeah, there was no fall damage. You're right. I didn't see that. Yeah. Hit the full twenty with the jetpack, though. Yeah, and goes again. Play mode. I think it's another full twenty. If I'm not mistaken. It falls down. Doesn't blow him into the water, but goes for the. 
Put the scout down. Well, uh, this is quite a... It's a hard shot, but it catches it. Whoa! Oh, it? Oh. Oh. Holy! Oh, Axe is going... Uh, yeah. yeah, he's putting the next gear. He's putting the top gear. Oh, and uh, of course. Part of the, the, the grenadier is up. I think Axby has practiced this map a lot. I think he's had the chance of practice, practicing it uh, since a uh, long time. I mean, this map has been in, in the game forever, so... And... Yeah, so suppose the uh, vanilla maps would have gotten a lot more... Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! Oh. Unlucky. Poor in the front. I wasn't expecting, I'm sure. It's sometimes with angles from firing from a hill that does happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to angle it even that low. But now Axby has the chance to oof, take advantage from this. Little mistake here. Bruce is a little bit of health swimming, but I suppose for any pig without a jetpack on this map, that's practically a given. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really could, what could happen here? Is that close enough to the edge? I don't think so. Uh, he will just well, definitely take a little damage. Oh. Hold on. Okay, he's fine. He finds his way back. But yeah, in this map, it might actually happen. It's quite frequent in some specific parts of the map to have um, out of bound picks. <laughs> oh, he skipped across the water. Yeah, he did. Whoa. That was quite a bit of water damage, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he was swimming for a while. That's it's probably at least 15. Mm -mm. And that's probably... Okay, this has to connect now. Come on. And that's it yes. for uh, Axe Vice Grand Gear, yeah. So in this game, we'll see... I'm not sure the standing of uh, Axby and uh, Lefront as far as like tournament points go. I'm sorry about that. I didn't do my homework, but it's still mm, pretty sure it's very important for them to win. So I'm uh, try. not sure where either. Yeah. Okay, so uh, Axby does not decide to go for the double poison, but he goes for the safe one. Pretty safe. Oh wait! Oh no. Okay. Ooh. If that just bounced off the tree? Yeah, it could have bounced uh, favorably for Axby, but he decides to prime it anyway to stop the gas in case his own pig gets damaged, I suppose. So, I believe he's going for the crate now. Indeed. With it being a, a rocket launcher, it would be uh, useful to get a straight shot right across the hill. Think but... if he can make that. Oh, this looks so hard if you ask me. Oh, that's close. And it misses. And we missed. Yeah. That's just like I said in the last round. <laughs> you have to be very careful with it. Exactly. Exactly. It's not so bad if there's a wall behind them, but. <laughs> yeah, or if you aim at the ground, you know. Just don't use it as a sniper rifle, basically. That's the message, I suppose. Oh, and the medic still has some... Hmm. wonder why he hasn't used the mines. Hmm. I think he needs more time. Uh, every pig is far from these guys. So. But... I see Axby go again with the para. He might be able to get rid of the enemy paratrooper. That's a... Rocket launcher there, I think. Oh no, those are jetpacks. Okay. Even more jetpacks for this para. Oh, I see. He decided to distance himself from the medic because of this. I'm not sure if he wants to get rid of him already, but... Oh, I, I don't see. Think, yeah, I don't think he can go, like, out of boundaries from here. He's definitely gonna try. Ah, but the angle is not the right one. Oh, but... Eh. Water damage, huh? That was a very decent water damage there. Actually, that was surprisingly good damage for a turn. <laughs> yeah. We didn't want to write anything up. I agree. 
Oh, and now LeFrance is gonna up the ante Ooh, here. Could he spin back? If he knocks mm. him kind of to the left, he might lose a lot more health. Yep. Oh, he almost falls oh, out of balance. Oh no, what's happening? Oh my god. What? I mean, he can try, he just have a different thing. <laughs> he tried three times the same thing, exactly. I don't know how we could make it. Like, <laughs> precisely the same. Yeah. That bug definitely breaks what would otherwise be an absolutely brutal, lethal turn, but... Yeah. It's really, it's really, like, sad that uh, LeFront has to spend the... Uh, change his strategy because of game bag. I mean, <laughs> it is Ox, Ox of War we're talking about, so it's not like we can change much about it. But we'll see, we'll see. So it doesn't happen again. Oh, for sure. Eh, it seems fine so far. I think it was actually a pretty good uh, move as well. So we have uh, Axe Spy going. Now it's gonna be his turn. And with that out of the way, I'm gonna put a very, very subtle. Uh, we're gonna smoothly go forward with the game after that. You jinxed us once before. Oh man. Uh, yeah, we'll still with a TNT shot, that, uh, that'll be enough to take out the paratrooper. <laughs> so we'll see if Axby gets the kill, he does, and just hope the game does not crash anymore, to be honest. <laughs> Yeah, I think we'll be fine as long as they don't aim for the edges of the absolute edges of the map. Indeed. So we see the sapper going uh, next. Uh, will he make another decent water that damage? Hmm. I see the two pigs bunched up close together there. But oh, does he have nice. time? Oh, does he know he goes with the rocket launcher? Please don't very precise, do the same bug. Oh, oh and what the hell? <laughs> just 24, but... Pretty hard to shoot with the rocket launcher, so, you know. Yeah, especially with the input lag from Parsec, that does make it difficult. Yep. It's basically the hardest bullet-based weapon to use. And the medic is out. Hmm. Once again... So, oh, I think I can start to see a lead forming here. Yeah, but sadly enough. Turn might go well. Okay, let's hope that this out of bounds <gasps> trick will not make the game crash. Please, please don't crash. <laughs> <laughs> I share your desperation in that. Let's see. It might just be on my side. I really have no clue how to fix it. But it oh my god, that looks creepy. Okay. Whoop. He's dead. That's it. Whew. Right, thankfully, no crash. No crashes. I'm so glad. <laughs> For those of you guys who... I mean, I'm not sure if I will have to cut everything, but I think I will. What happened was uh, Lefrot was taking a TNT to Axe by his uh, poisoned, par uh, poisoned engineer get him almost out of bounds with his uh, TNT blast. And then the game would crash before the par the engineer would reach uh, ground again, so... Uh, sadly, LeFront had to just change his move to a less optimal one, so I'm not sure how to proceed on that. Almost tempted yeah, of giving it would have been such a good move. Yeah, but for a limitation of the game engine, I suppose. Or the emulator. Uh, had to be different, but now... It's a still a 2v2, and I'm not sure, I don't think there's a scout in uh, Axe by Steam. I mean, not a uh, live one. Might be wrong, actually. Ooh. So with some water damage, that's likely him finished. Yeah, looks like it's a good one. It's a good little fight back, but we'll have to see how the next few turns play out. Yeah. Oh, and this... Oh my god, just about... Ooh, just, just skipping in there. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh yeah, he acts by has a his scout still up and running. So Sapper's gonna go and um, hit the others. Oh my god! Oh no! What's oh, happening? No. Uh, Axe by Sinfamous Vodka Controller. This is a joke that only the Italian guys forget. Oh, he finds... He finds the engineer. I'm not sure if he's gonna go for that. Oh, yeah. But I don't think there's enough room for some water damage. Might be wrong. Maybe Let's a see. little. A tiny bit, but... Hmm? The other one who's poisoned. Just dealing a little bit of damage to him. Oh. To steal one extra turn. That could... Indeed. I mean, I I want I want to damage him quickly just so he can't swim over soon. Yeah, but finally the front has an easier um, uh, rocket launcher shot, and he goes for it very very confidently, and he does get it, and he Ooh. bounces back. Hmm, still at ninety, pretty healthy so far. Hmm. I don't think this scout has swam before in this game. I swimmed. I think so. It's the first bath. Hmm. And with the 136, he's poisoned. And on a lower health anyway. Yeah, and he finds it. And that's by with two pigs left. And we're down to our last engineer. Mm -mm. Yeah, and uh, he's also poisoned, so... Oh my gosh. Well, okay, but, he... He, but he does have serious weaponry, though. Oh, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> oh, if he gets a trick shot with a shrapnel, that... He goes for extreme measures. I think it's gonna be Scout's turn next, though. Yeah, he goes for the... Oh, wait, where did he put it? I think he panicked a little bit. I'm not sure. Hmm. What's it gonna do? That's gonna be at least 35. Oh, it's a full 50. Okay, I don't understand. But oh, ho, ho. Ooh, that's, good. that's good. He's in. That was very Lots good. Lots of damage. That's less than 15 health left for this guy. Yeah. He's but... definitely weakened. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He's gonna go for... Okay, he has to do... Perfect shrapnel here, and uh, take away at least 50 HP in order to win this. Actually, yeah, it, if he makes a trick shot, that's game. But I mean, it's not like... Even a 30 can be lethal, I think. We'll see. Oh my god, yes. devastating 70! Out of nothing. I only took one extra shrapnel leave that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well. That's it. And that seals the deal. X by brings this yes. home two to one. Good but, game, congratulations, X by. Yeah, I mean, other than a technical issue there, I think X by has uh, done a really good game. Like same for Lefranc. I'm just sorry that he had to change his strategy because of a technical bug, but uh, let's hope it didn't influence the result that much. And you have any concluding uh, thoughts that you wanna say, Crypto? Yeah, I was, that was a really great uh, match from from all from uh, both of them, really. Very well played. Some uh, insane moves on, on each of the maps, actually, <laughs> I think. Uh, that uh, shrapnel at the end, I didn't mean to predict <laughs> that that accurately. <laughs> but yeah, well played, guys. Uh, I'm glad yeah. I could help again, and I'll hopefully see you all soon. Absolutely. Thank you so much for joining me, Crypto, and um, see you guys in the next match. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.